are you resisting change or do you feel out of alignment with where you're heading or where you thought you were heading with your business? Or do you maybe feel like that so much more is possible, but you're maybe even afraid to actually finding out what that would look like? Hi, I'm Kay Sanders, also known as the creator of Possibilities. I'm your intuitive business coach, helping you turn your passion into a successful and thriving business. Now, a lot of change has been happening lately, like energy has been shifting, emotions and memories from the past might be coming up, you know, coming to the surface. And some have actually been very shaken up to the core about all the shifting that's been going on. Like it's moving us into the direction that we're meant to go into, but oftentimes we're really resisting that. We are very, very resistant of, you know, what comes up. We might try to push all the stuff down, all the memories that are coming up. I mean, they're coming up for a reason. Now, last month, for example, was a very challenging month for me. Month of May was very challenging for me. I was going through my spiritual awakening. I was... I also would like to call it an identity crisis because that's how it feel, felt like because I was questioning everything. I was questioning who I was, what I'm here to do, who I'm meant to serve, you know, if my business is really still in alignment. I mean, I was questioning everything and that was because I was resisting it. But this whole identity crisis, this spiritual awakening, this, this all these things coming up for me, it came up for a reason. It helped me find my true path and really readjust my approach. And it also helped me, it was, I was guided to creating more videos, to sharing my message widely, to speak more, to be out there more. And that actually was one of the things that I was resisting the most. Yes, I had been out there. Yes, I had been on social media. I had built my network. I have been doing speaking engagements, like virtual speaking engagements, being in, being interviewed, but I was meant to step up my game and I was resisting that. I was resisting that for a very, very long time. And I got smacked really, really hard by the the universe. And it felt like an identity crisis, but it helped me really figure out what I'm meant to do, what I'm here to do. And thankfully my business is, is still in alignment with what I am meant to do here. So I'm not going anywhere. Thank God for that, right? Now, let me ask you, are you resisting the change? Are you resisting what you are meant to do, the, the big purpose you are meant to meant to step into. Now, whatever is coming up for you, especially over these last, I mean, I think these last six months, you know, the entire is 2018 so far has been very challenging for many people, where many people have gone through spiritual awakening, where have gone through so, quote unquote identity crisis to help them really figure out what they're meant to do here on earth, you know, what they're meant to do in this lifetime. Now, if you're going through these challenging times as well, like think of it, like whatever comes up for you, it comes up for a reason. It is giving you the opportunity to let go of it all. It allows you to shed all that no longer serves you, all these memories from the, from the past, the pain, the discomfort, the disappointments, it's all coming up to give you the opportunity to let go of it. It allows you to really step into your true self and onto your right path. And that is the most important things. Now, if you're resisting this, if you're resisting the, the smacks by the universe, if you're resisting whatever comes up, if you're just trying to push it down and you don't want to deal with it, you don't want to work through this, it will keep you stuck. It will not allow you to embrace who you are. It would not allow you to really step into who you are meant to become, who you are meant to, you know, the, the big purpose you have in life. Now, embrace the change and you will be on your path and it might be uncomfortable at first but let me tell you once you really allow yourself to really take a step back and say who am i what am i here to do and you just wait for the guidance to come for the answers to come they may not come right away but they will come and i'm telling you it will be amazing whatever comes up for you now it will really be the best decision that you've ever made because you allow yourself to let go and stop resisting. Now, the universe knows best, and we all know that, right? The universe knows best. Your inner guidance knows best. And it's all here to guide you onto your path. Now, whatever comes up for you, like I mentioned, it comes up for a reason. It puts, it gives you the choice to let go of it. Now, tap into your heart and ask yourself, what do you truly desire? What do you truly want for yourself, for your life, for your family, for, you know, your loved ones? What do you truly desire? 
Now, whatever comes up for you, check in with yourself. What are you resisting? What is keeping you really from getting exactly that, exactly what you desire? Then let go of that resistance. Really take a step back and say, universe, show me what, what, what you got. You show me how to move forward. What is my next step? And really embrace your divine self. De- embrace your, your divine gifts and go after what your heart desires. You are divine and you can be, do and have anything that your heart desires. So stop resisting the change that is really necessary to make it happen. Now, I hope this quickie was that this quick video was was helpful for you and I will see you next time in the next quick video. I hope you have an amazingly abundant and successful day.